Hi there, I'm John from CNCROI.com and today what we'll do, we'll take a look at laser engraved glass. CNCROI.com has two different ways of marking permanently glass, such as this here. So this case here, it was done with our laser. And the other way of doing it is with an industrial sandblaster, which we also have. Now each one has a plus and a minus, it depends on the application. The nice thing about a sandblaster is that it's like a random frostiness. Well with a laser, like this sample here, you can still achieve a similar result, it just takes a lot more time. So it basically comes down to like a yin and a yang. You have the advantage of this one, advantage of that one, and the application would decide which one's the best tool for the end result that you're looking for. For instance, if you have, let's say, 100 different um, glass name badges, which we can make, and they'll have a different name, uh, and contact information, and so forth, it's definitely more efficient to use a laser for that, uh, just because the process is just for fit, far more efficient. If you want to do something, let's say, where you have a one-off on a very high-end glass trophy that, ha that is rounded, for instance, which is something that's very hard to handle with a laser, Sandblaster wins. So what we'll do now, we'll take a look at what I just showed you being made with our laser. Now you know how this was made. Now there's some distinctive differences between how a sandblaster works versus a laser. You have a flat surface here. What the laser is is an inverted cone and it just warms up the very top surface of the glass shattering it. That's how you get the frostiness here. Now this one here was done several times so you cannot tell if it was done with a laser or a sandblaster. Sandblaster, on the other hand, you put a mask over it and you're basically throwing sand at it to scratch the surface, producing identical result to this. So if you have something that's roundish, the challenge with the laser is that you're always based on that one focal spot. Uh, we have a rotary system, so let's say you have a wine bottle, we can actually do that in the shop here without having to go to the sandblaster. But if you had a, a surface that was very uneven, it would be incredibly challenging to get that focal point perfect every time. So you end up with the differences, different in shattering results. Uh, with a sandblaster, it's just, just straight aggregate throwing against the material 
and you end up with the same similar result, frostiness. So if you need anything done out of glass, contact cncri.com and we'll get those things done for you.